Uh, in this video, I'm gonna show you how you can use tables to lay out components in your templates. Uh, I have added uh, three new columns here and I would like to display them in a template. Uh, when you go to the templates gallery, there you find a table layout, uh, example of table layout template. So, first thing, so let's make a copy of it. And let's have a closer look what we have here. So in the first cell we have the uh, we have a yellow table and then we have another blue table in it with just uh, zero border now. So if I set it to zero you can see how it works. So we have here a, we're gonna have here a QR code but as these two cells are merged then you can place text and text text next to it yeah and what I would like to do now I would like to put next here next to the first QR code I would like to put the dimensions what I have in a sheet next to it so first I just want to get rid of the column and make the table a little bit wider then we unmerge cells and I insert new table here so we have three new values so it's gonna be uh, let me go back so it's gonna be like width sorry and Okay, I'm not gonna do any further formatting here. So we have three new values here, and we place them next to the main, the main or oh, first uh, QR code. Let me go back to the add-on. Then we need to load newly created template. <coughs> and we need to do the mapping. So code is QR, we take values from code column as a QR code in small size. We take width as a text length and height. Okay, then we have name. We do name as text. We have a code that, that's gonna be again a text field. Email is QR and we take it from email as QR code and let's keep it let's keep it tiny and we have an email as text okay we are done and we can generate the output document and see how that's gonna look like <coughs> Okay, so yeah, as we can see, maybe we could adjust the, in the template and make the, the first column a little bit wider so the QR fits in well. That's gonna be the next, next thing to do, but otherwise it looks pretty good. So keep in mind, using the tables, you can create really complex uh, table layouts and position elements next to each other. Thank you for watching.